Hey, Jeff Howard here at Kiteboarding.com. And again, we get those questions from our customers asking to do a neat little video. Now, what I want to talk about is the season is just getting underway. And there's a lot of little things that we can do to help out at our kiting spots. And what I want to call that is kind of like a kite etiquette. What can you do to help out around your area? Now, first off, remember, every one of you and me, we were beginners at one time. So always help those people out. If someone comes up to your beach and you're wondering if they're going to be safe, the safest spot is you helping them out. If you see them show up, you've never seen them, go introduce yourself. Let's talk with them. Help them out. Find out what level they're at. Give them some uh, input of how you launch and how things uh, are done at your area and launching of your kites of, of specific places. This is so important. I have, have seen people just sit around, not say anything, and just watch. This is when the danger comes. We've all been beginners at one point. We've all come to a new area. And if you don't know that new area, ask somebody. They know how everything is done to keep everything safe so we can keep all of our beaches open. Now, there's a few other little etiquette things that I'd like to say over the years of kiting that I've seen that I'd like to try to teach people. One, so when you're riding, this is all about the beach. On the beach or in your area of launching, what can you do? One, roll up your lines. If you let your kite sit down, you're taking a break, you're having a beer, getting a drink, hanging out with some friends, don't leave your lines all hanging out. It's very simple. Roll your lines up on your bar, set it by your kite, and move all of it out of the way. Move it out of the way of the launch spot. There's usually one area where everybody launches, but you'll see somebody come down, set their kite, and leave their lines out. But remember, we share the beach with others. We don't own the parks, we don't own the beaches, but if we make it easier for everyone else, a beachgoer doesn't know about our lines. Getting your feet tangled in them, tripping a kid with all your stuff hanging out. So simply, just roll up your lines, set your stuff out of the way, let's share the beach, let's be loved by others, and we'll usually keep those areas open. Another thing you can do is make sure that your boards, if you set your boards anywhere on the beach, set them out of the way, and most importantly, fins down. You want your fins down. If someone trips, falls, we've all done it, we've all been pulled by our kite, and if those fins are up on one of those boards, you can see that can become very dangerous. Now, another thing that you can do at your area is help clean up. If you're sitting there hanging out, I love to walk down to the beach. Sometimes the winds aren't the best that I want to go ride in and I'm just hanging out. Go clean up some trash. If we're all there to help out, do a little bit, we share it, it'll all come back to us. As we all know, karma is there. So, clean it up. Take care of your area. Other people will notice this. I love doing it and the next thing you know, you will see more people doing the same thing and helping you out. So, remember that. You are a beginner at one point, and that's a good thing. Now, another thing I like to do is I keep my eyes out, having extra gear. You know it's a bummer to show up at the beach. The next thing you know, you forgot your pump. The next thing you know, you forgot your leash. Now, I see a guy loading up, getting ready to leave. He just got there. I usually run up and ask, hey, what's going on? I forgot my pump. Hey, got one of those. No problem at all. This just makes a friend, get someone else riding, and that's, again, karma. It'll come back to you sometime. Have an extra leash or an extra line or something you got around. Help those. Having more people to come out and ride with you, riding by yourself is boring, more people is more fun, so keep clear. Now, the next one is a big thing that we have. A lot of people say, what is my right of way on the water? What should I do about on the water? What can I do to help others on the water? Number one, beginners have right of way. This is very important. If I can ride and steer clear of them, I should stay away from them. It's that easy. They are going to learn. Don't get mad at them. Don't yell. If it's after the fact and you're up on the beach, go mention it. Say, hey, you're looking good out there. Talk positive and then mention, you know, give a little space, you know, upwind. So if you're upwind, your kite is high. If you're downwind, your kite is low. Give that clearance if you see someone coming at you. Make sure. So remember, if your kite's up and you're upwind, keep your kite up. And let's the other one pass under. That's very important. So give those beginners right of way. Give the right of way of upwind and downwind. And again, if you see someone having a problem, stay clear of them. They get scared and you can spook them. Another one that we had a lot of people say is don't tailgate. Now, if you're riding up close to somebody, make sure that they know that you're there, that you're coming up on them. They don't hear it. Water splashing, wind blowing, and everything else. I've seen that so quick. Someone coming right up behind, you're a good rider, you're following that person, and they don't know you're there. If you think that they might turn, go ahead and turn and head out. Give them that clearance, give them that space, or notify them that you're coming. A lot of friends I like to ride real close to and cruise around with, but make sure that they know that you're there. And final of all, 
be a good role model. Help those people out. You are the one that's down there. You've been there for years. You've got the experience. Help everyone out. And at the final end, have fun. That's what we're all into this for. So if you see someone that doesn't seem right, don't get upset. Go talk with them. You can help out. Keep your area clean. Keep your area happy. And everybody out on that water. That's Jeff Howard here at Kiteboarding.com. Have fun on the water this season. And you give us a call if you have any questions or you'd like to see some videos on anything. I'll help you out. That's Jeff Howard here, Kiteboarding.com with the Hulk. Have a great season.